So we sent our Kaylee Hunt down to Watanabe, Florida to check out the latest selection. Morning, Kaylee. Good morning, and you are correct. Every year I give my mother a what? A bouquet of beautiful flowers. And behind me, look at these gorgeous, exotic, beautiful flower bouquets. And with us once again is Monty. Thank you so much for having us and showing us. Let's first talk about this beautiful bouquet of flowers. What are they called and how can people get some? Well, these are, this is part of our Mother's Day collection. So this is called our exotic hue, something that's a little bit bigger, probably more appropriate for a larger home or a walkway. Uh, something that's going to be very big in, on display, but it, I love it because it's so bright. It's so colorful It'll definitely bring a smile to mom or grandmother or whoever you're going to give this to so uh, Full of locally grown tropical flowers. So that's something that's another plus We're using local growers to produce these flowers and then we're using these to create this. It's it's a uh, I love one of my it. favorites now I'm sure viewers have noticed we've kind of moved a little bit and we're actually kind of behind the scenes If you want to take a look, let's go behind this little area and you can see where the magic happens. Is yeah, it safe to say that? Absolutely. This is our design center. So our store doesn't open until 9 o'clock today, but you can see that we're in full, uh, you know, prep mode for Mother's Day week. It's just the beginning of the week. We're, they're going to be producing, you know, up to 4,000 arrangements this week. So it's going to be a long but fun week for all of us because we know that at the end of the week, we're going to make a tremendous amount of moms happy. And smiles on their faces. This is a busy week and a busy time. Now, there is a lay shortage going on. Can you tell us if that's impacting your business currently? It's, it's definitely going to have a big impact this week. There's certainly going to be a shortage of lay for mom this week. Um, right now, it's not too bad because the demand is not that high but you have a combination of problems the first thing you have is local farm growers have not gotten back to capacity since COVID uh, that's one problem then they don't have enough workers to string lay that's a second problem but what's the major problem right now is all of the orchid lays that are coming in from Asia are being confiscated by the Department of Agriculture so tens of thousands of lay have been uh, uh, confiscated in the last week. Obviously, that's going to create a shortage of lay for Mother's Day week. Flowers we're going to have in abundance, but the lay could be a problem towards towards the end of the week. That's good to know. Definitely for people who are eager to get their hands on these beautiful bouquets. So walk me through a little bit of price point. You know, I know there's a price point for everyone, but mm -hmm. what can people expect if they're, you know, ready to buy a beautiful bouquet? Well, our finished arrangements, the part of the line that we showed you in the front, starts at $79.99 and then that exotic queue that we showed you is at the upper price point about $159.99. In the store we have cut flowers, we have you know anything from 99 cents on up. So we're definitely going to have something for everyone but in finished pieces $79 and up. And don't forget free delivery still for today and tomorrow. That is such a special deal Monty. Thank you so much for talking to us this morning. I hope this you know reminds some of our viewers like myself. I forgot too that Mother's Day is this upcoming weekend. How crazy. Well, that's the latest for now. Reporting live at Wantanabe Floral, I'm Kaylee Hunt. Guys, I'll send it back over to you in studio. Thank you so much, Kaylee and Monty. They always do such a great job there at Wantanabe Floral. Beautiful.